If we wanted to figure out how much wedge we created with this shoe, what we would do is you start with figuring out the length of your shoe. And the other measurement that I'm going to need to know is I'm going to need to know the length or the height of my toe and the height of my heel and what the difference or the delta is. So the equation would look like this, shoe length times two times pi equals my circumference, okay? If I take x, I divide that by 360, that equals a, which would give me one degree over five and a quarter inches in this equation. That delta of a quarter inch, if I divide that by this number, gives me the degrees of which. So 10 and a half times pi equals, I'm rounding up to 33. 33 divided by 360 equaled 0 0.091. I'm gonna remember that number. So I'm gonna take my delta, because it's 5 sixteenths at the toe, 9 sixteenths at the heel. There's a quarter inch difference. So quarter inch divided by 0 0.091, and I ended up almost three degrees of wedge, 2.7 degrees of wedge with this shoe. I could have flattened that toe out a little bit, but we were coming just a little big, so I left a little bit more thickness in it. But that is how you figure out how much wedge you created when you build your shoe.